Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Tech Teamtronics channel. Today, we're doing a quick video on how I back up my music from my iPhone to the computer. And the program that I choose to use is Wondershare Tunes Go. This is a Tech Teamtronics production. And the reason I choose Tunes Go is because unlike other programs which I won't mention it doesn't delete all my files from the iPhone so what is Wondershare Tunes Go? Tunes Go is an app that you can download and install on your computer with this app you can manage not only music but also videos photos contacts messages apps and other files on your Apple iPhone or Android device you can even use it to make GIS what I have basically is a system by which I can move files from the Android to the iPhone and vice versa. Well, today, ladies and gentlemen, what we are going to do is since I have my iPhone connected, I'm just going to back up all my music to a location. So when you open the app, it looks like this. You see that my phone's connected. I have like that much space on my phone. The, pretty large that's all my music but I'm gonna go to the toolbox and then this is where I go to back up my device I'm not caring about messages contacts you can just check what you want I have a special place for music hopefully it picks it up on my NAS so I'm going to back it up to this PC. Create a name, name the new folder. It won't see my network drive, so I have to do it here. I mean, I could do it in, I could do it in a number of other places too, but we're just going to do it here. Uh, And we'll see how it goes. So you can see that the path that we saved to is here. The explanation marks means that these things such as apps and app data and call logs are not applicable to this device. So I'm going to go ahead and click backup and let it do its thing. And then we will explore the backup to see what we have. Okay, it looks like our backup is complete, ladies and gentlemen. So with that, let's take a look at what our backup has for us. Okay, it's just a backup file. Cool. Twenty-eight. No, it's twenty-six point eight gigabytes. On the. Now, that's how you do a backup. The cool thing about it too is you could you could use this to restore files to a device from a previous backup, which is always a good thing. There's other transfer tools. Transfer iTunes media and playlists to iOS or Android. You could do phone to phone transfers and all kinds of stuff. The other additional tools that we see at the bottom here are a GIF maker. You could fix a device which can't be recognized by iTunes. I never messed with that and I hope to never have to. And you got a ringtone maker. So it is possible to make a ringtone on your iPhone using this app. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's all I got to say about it. Thanks for watching and have a great day.